Welcome to my happy home, where I bring you DIYs, hauls, home decor, thrifting, and much more on a budget. If you are interested in these types of videos, then please like, comment, and subscribe. Hi friends, welcome back to my happy home. I'm so happy you stopped by. In today's video, I am sharing with you a small bathroom makeover or more of a refresh actually. It's the first time I am sharing my entire bathroom with you guys. I did share in previous videos this space here. I did a refresh just recently on here. In case you've missed that, I will leave it in the iCard up here. Before we dive into this clean and decorate with me video, let me show you uh, what the space looks like right now and how I have it decorated. And I had it like this for um, as long as I can remember actually, because I do not really decorate my bathroom for the different seasons, but I thought it was in much need of a refresh. So I decided to share that with you. As you can see, it is not a big bathroom, but I do like this space and I'm trying to create a spa-like feeling. And here is my shower area and you guys, really, this is real life. I really need all this stuff, my personal and dental hygiene, my hair supplies and my facial supplies. So please don't judge me. And next to the shower is my toilet and you guys, yes, I do have a car stereo installed in my bathroom because I really love to enjoy music when I take a bath or when I wake up in the morning to take my shower. I do have nautical speakers as you can see here and I absolutely love this you guys, I can totally recommend it. With all of that being said, let's move on to the cleaning part. I'm using this toilet cleaner and I absolutely love this stuff. It is a foam and I just cover the entire toilet seat with it as you can see. And then I drop in a cleaning tablet and I let everything dissolve. And after I think maybe 10 minutes, I can clean it up with these bathroom surface wipes. And I always use these uh, antibacterial wipes because, well, I think it's more hygienical if you are cleaning your toilet and not using like the same cloth over and over again. I don't know about you guys, but sometimes I have these wet towels that go dry and I think it is such a waste to throw them out. So what I do, I use them as a dust collector because I think they are perfect for that. I always like to do a dusting off before I go in to clean out with a wet towel. Now to clean my bathtub, I use bleach and a little bit of method all-purpose cleaning. I just spray it all around and then I go in with a towel to wipe down the entire bathtub. And I do the same for my bathroom sink and I actually use the all-purpose cleaner just to mask the smell of the bleach a little. Now I always clean my bathroom using these pink disposable cleaning cloths and what I like about them is, is that they are really sturdy and even though they are reusable I do dispose of them after one use in my bathroom because of um, hygienic reasons. Now I use my Method Floor Solution to mop my floor and I absolutely love the citrus scent that it uh, spreads after I'm done cleaning. And I'm mopping my floor with this so so handy mop that I really love. I like that it has this container to uh, hold your own cleaning solution. But what I love about this is that the cleaning cloth comes off really easy so you can throw it in the wash after you're done mopping. Now I was looking to create more decorating space in my small bathroom when I came across this shelving unit that I think was absolutely perfect because it not only gives us this um, glamorous modern look but it also creates more uh, decorating space in a small bathroom. After the cleaning, I am ready to move on to the decorating part. Now, as I mentioned in the beginning of this video, I really want to create that spa-like feeling in this uh, bathroom. So I'm going to add a lot of greenery to achieve that look. 
Okay, you guys, let me show you something. I uh, am going to decorate with these towels. I had white towels and I switched them out for these uh, uh, blush pink ones. And let me show you a little trick because I've seen some uh, pretty towels going around with all that bling and I just cannot find those here and even if I do, it is not within my budget. So let me show you a little trick that I have. Now you all know these bling wraps, you can use them to embellish just about anything. Here I am wrapping it around and tucking it between the towels to create a luxurious look. And this is how it looks. I think this is gorgeous. So anyway, this is my simple tip on a budget to create some glam towels to decorate with. Now, as I mentioned, I like to add a lot of green into the space, so I am sprucing up this small tray with these succulents. And if you remember, at the beginning I had this beautiful faux fern here, and I wanted something different, but I still wanted to recreate that green look here. So for that I am using this beautiful thrifted gold planter, and I got these faux grass plants um, at the beginning of the year on sale, and I got them for $1.50 each, and the original price tags on these were $5.99, so I thought for $1.50 that was a really good deal. Since I don't have a lot of decorating space here on my sink, I wanted to do something that had a big impact, so I'm using this beautiful thrifted orchid. And this is the finished look and I'm absolutely in love with how everything turned out. And as you can see from the beginning, it isn't really completely different. I did switch out a few items, but I think the pops of pink and all the greenery that I incorporated really made such a big difference to the space. And I think it actually really achieved the spa-like feeling that I was going for. No who's suffocating me slow I'm sick and I need your love But I can't get enough of you So that is it for this video and I hope that you have 
enjoy this and that I could have given you some inspiration. It is always a challenge to decorate a small space, but I think I really pulled it off and I am really happy with the end result, the spa-like feeling and all the greeneries that I have incorporated in this space. So um, yeah, I hope that you have enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you're not a subscriber yet, I would totally love it. If you would consider hitting that subscribe button and become a resident of my happy home. If you enjoyed this video, just go ahead and do so. It doesn't cost you anything, but it really helps my channel out a lot. So for now, I want to thank you all so, so much for watching. And I see you in the next one. Bye.